Hey guys, so I wanted to do a project. This is my first time doing this, so your lear um, learning is as I go. So if this works out, this would be the best way to uh, put glitter on your shirts. Um, basically, you'll need some Mod Podge. You can get it at Walmart or any kind of craft store. I think in Lowe's as well. I got these stencils at Walmart. They come in these boxes. I forgot how much it is, but there's like a whole bunch of um, designs and stuff on there, which I'm doing the that right there the one the red you'll need a pack of uh, glitter or any kind of glitter I got these from Walmart they also sell them at the Dollar Tree you'll need some sponges as well and some tape any kind of tape I'm using electrical tape because I don't know what my other tape is but basically I put my uh, the, the stencil down on the shirt and then there's a piece of wood underneath here so it won't go through the other shirt with this stencil being folded the way it is so basically what I'm doing is pushing it down and I put the glitter in the Mod Podge as you can see there's glitter in there so this is the first coat I'm gonna let this dry for like 15 minutes uh, it says 15 to 20 minutes so I'm gonna let this dry or you can use a uh, I'm pretty sure I'm gonna go get me a uh, hair dryer and dry it quicker so I'm gonna put at least two or three coats on this and see how good it does and then I'm going to do a pair of blue jeans as well. But uh, stay tuned and I will show you the next step. Okay, so I got the second coat on there. Basically what I'm doing is I'm pushing it back down and I'm da like uh, taking the sponge and basically dabbing it on there. Don't, you know, because the shirt will move if you don't have it tight enough. So just dab it on there. This is the second coat. As you can see, it actually, uh, where the stencil is coming up that the, it's not getting on there so I'm gonna go ahead and I've got a blow dryer so I'm gonna blow dry this and put a third coat on blow dry that and I'm gonna take this stencil off and we're gonna find out what it looks like okay I got the third layer on there so I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna blow dry this real quick and then with a moment okay so it's almost dry I don't want to dry it too good because then it'd be hard to get this off of here so we're gonna head and take this tape off the shirt with the stencil to find out if it looks like crap or if it looks good and hopefully it looks good because I really hope this does turn out really good if I get this tape off of here I wish I had my other tape because uh, it would work a lot better okay Um, let me go ahead and take this off and I'll show you what it looks like. Okay, as you can see, you got to be very careful when you take your stencil off because it, it is a uh, Mod Podge and it will kind of like stick that because you're going over the stencil. But basically your stencil is glitter now, but you can still reuse it. Uh, just make sure that you go through and uh, wherever the Mod Podge was glued at to uh, get that off of there. But this is what it looks like. I'm going to go ahead and um, the bottom kind of messed up right here, I guess, because I moved it. But that's okay. But uh, yeah, this is a Mod Pod shirt. And I'm going to go ahead and uh, show you after. But yeah, basically, this is the shirt and it's uh, glittered. And uh, I'm going to go start ahead and uh, I went to the thrift store and got some stuff. So I'm going to go ahead and Mod Podge some more stuff. But uh, I hope this helps. Um, if you have any questions or if you want me to try anything, just let me know. Bye, guys.